Okay, my final thoughts and reviews on this mower. I I didn't do the whole front yard here, but I did do the patch up front on the street and just the uh, perimeter around the main part of the yard. Um, this part over here, I did like a, that part. I didn't do the center around the tree. It doesn't grow as much in the center, and I usually let that grow out a little longer. Um, so let me take it, that's the front yard, and let me take it to the backyard now. And uh, I did about half the backyard because, I'll show you. Excuse the mess, we're doing some housework. All right, here's the backyard, and uh, there's the dog and the mower. Um, I did half the yard because I used the battery and did the whole front yard and the backyard about a week ago. And uh, then I just did the whole front yard and half the back and the battery died, so I'm recharging it. And that should take about 45 minutes to an hour. Uh, my reviews are, <clears throat> there's this uh, Greenworks Pro 80 volt. Well, now the 240 volt, same thing, but just smaller battery and two of them. And then you got, like I was mentioning in the first video, you got that big gray one. I forgot the name of it, but uh, the Ego, uh, that's the main competitor for this mower is the Ego. Um, the Ego just looked too big and clunky, and it was too expensive. It was like $300 more and uh, less powerful. Uh, it also... Um, <clears throat> It just looked like it was made out of like cheap plastic. I know plastic might even be better than metal, but I'm an old school. I like metal. I like heavy. I like solid. Uh, even though this thing's not solid. I mean, it's not heavy. It's light, but it is solid. This thing's metal um, and then plastic on top, but it's okay. Uh, so my final reviews are I, the first month I got this, I wasn't, I was very skeptic on an electric mower, a plastic mower, this, that, $400. So I, I beat this thing to hell. I beat the shit out of it. And uh, I put it through. I wanted to abuse it. And I was trying to kill it or bog it down and just destroy it. Just to, just to prove myself right that I need a, a, a gas mower that's solid metal. Maybe the Toro or something. Well, actually, the Toro's um, electric now too. This thing, I would take over the Toro or the Ego any day of the week. And it's less money. If you're going to get an electric mower... I highly recommend this one. This is the one, the Greenworks Pro 80 volt or the Greenworks Pro 240 volt. Um, I couldn't beat it up. I couldn't break it. I couldn't kill it. The month went by, the return policy ended and I was stuck with it and I'm very, very happy. It was the best $400 spent on this house so far, hands down. Um, <clears throat> no complaints. I, I'm trying to think of a complaint. Um, battery last I got maybe a th I guess a third or a, a little over a quarter acre property and this thing mows the yard and a half on one battery without with ease um, as I was saying in the the video earlier the first video that uh, when you mow and then you mow through a heavy patch or a wet patch or it's having a little trouble it automatically revs up double the speed and power can't stop this mower nothing can stop this mower I've gone over rocks I got rocks in the yard that I've hit. And of course, that would bog it down a rock, and it did. It made a loud bang noise and this and that. Probably dulled the blade up to shit. But it still is a beast. And I, I, I just don't have any complaints. The only complaint I have is why didn't I get this thing sooner? Why didn't they come out with this technology sooner? But, I mean, so basically, it's, it's thumbs up, 100% approval rating. And uh, if you're going to get a mower and you do and you want to push mower, this is the one to get. The Greenworks Pro 80 Volt, for sure. I am going to get uh, the other, I'm going to get a, a weed whacker as well because I had a, a works weed whacker that was shit and cheap. And it got me through the summer, but it sucks. And I'm, I'm, I'm going to upgrade and get the 40 volt battery for that so I have all the same appliances outside and batteries that are matching set. So that's my review, and uh, I hope you enjoyed these three videos. And uh, just take, I'm going to zoom in. I want you to get a good look at the lawn. Look how nice that is. That's wet grass. That was probably 8 to 10 inch tall wet grass, and it went through like butter. 
Sorry about that little brown spot right there. That's the doggy pool that I have for my dog when it was hot in the summer. And uh, look at that lawn, baby. That is so much nicer.